Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Thank you to everyone who's subscribed so far. If you haven't already subscribed, you can subscribe here at Kenny Tut on YouTube where you'll find recipes added all the time as well as cocktails and just general love, general love to share. But thank you everyone, thank you for subscribing. Chat to me, if there's any recipes that you wanna see, then let me know. But anyway, what have we got today? Something a little bit special and I was sitting in the garden earlier thinking there would be a great cocktail and then I thought the Dark and Stormy. An absolute legendary cocktail. Actually came from Bermuda, so it was brought over to the States by sailors from Bermuda and became just a massive sensation on the east coast of America and has been rocking and rolling since. It's an absolute brilliant cocktail and again only a few ingredients. So what are you going to need? Number one, rum. You can't do a dark and stormy without rum, are you crazy? This is a Jamaican rum Blackwell. It's rich, it's fiery, it's, it's got warmth in the belly. Something dark, a dark rum, not spiced. You want the rum to shine through with the lime and the other bits and bobs that you've got in there. Then we've got some brown sugar, some demerara sugar. And that's really important because what that's gonna do is that's gonna help when we smash up the limes, bring all the oils and the beautiful juices out of the lime as well. Uh, then you have, I've just said it, you guessed it, a lime and a nice slice there to garnish. And then ginger beer. Any ginger beer, I've got the old fever tree here. But any ginger beer you can get your hands on, um, or ginger ale, whatever it may be. And then you need ice. So you need ice for when you're shaking it and ice for when you're making it. Do you like that? <laughs> yeah, so ice when you're shaking it, ice when you're making it. And then to serve it, we just got a nice highball glass here, nice and easy. So let's get cracking. First of all, we've got our cocktail shaker. We're gonna go in with some of this beautiful lime here. Um, in there. We managed to freeze some, some of our citrus fruit. So we've got bags in the freezer of chopped up lime, chopped up lemon, because you never know when you're going to need it. So just a little tip there, you can freeze citrus, it freezes really well uh, in the fridge. So we've got our lime in there, and then I'm going to take a nice tablespoon, roughly, of the demerara sugar, a nice coarse brown sugar in there. And then all you're going to do is get your, get something in to crush it. You can use a rolling pin and just really muddle that around. Get all of that beautiful oil out of the zest of the lime. And just, just you know, give it some, give it some love. It just helps break it down uh, and get all the lovely juice out. Uh, very much like when you put salt with garlic to, to uh, crush garlic. It's a similar sort of thing. Abrasion is the word. There you go. There you go. My English teachers will be buzzing uh, that I know stuff. Um, so that's that. And then you're going to go in with the main stuff. You're going to go in with, with a nice 50 mil of a nice dark rum. This is called a jigger, this thing here. So we're going to fill the jigger, the meal, but a shot glass will be absolutely spot on. Get that straight in there. Lovely. So we're going to get a nice handful of ice. You almost want to fill it up because what that does, again, it just adds a solution. It boils it down a little bit and makes it the, the drink that you want. So you've got the, that in there. And then you're going to go on with the top, give it a little whack, get your cocktail shaker. This is the fun bit. It's about 10, 15 seconds. But yeah, something like that would be great. When it starts hurting your hands. There you go. Spot on. We're nearly there. It's that simple. Get your highball glass ready. Get it ready. Put it there. And then we're just going to whack the side. Excellent. Give it a little taste. Get yourself a straw. Straight in. It's all right, don't worry, it's just a little, little, little tad more there, no problems. Um, so that's basically the base of your drink. You're then just gonna strain it into your glass. So we've got this beautiful contraption here, just a little strainer, but you can just use a sieve, works absolutely fine. And then all we're gonna do with that is we're just gonna pour it, like so, keep going, keep pouring it in. Don't waste a drop. Excellent. And then we're going to go in with some ice. Good few cubes of ice in there as well. Block that in there. Lovely. All the way to the top. And then we're just going to top it up with some ginger beer. Go. And then last, definitely not least, a nice big slice of lime there. So there we have it. Again, just a few ingredients. 
great to sit out on the decking with a nice glass of your uh, dark and stormy, but they are a bit lethal. So just be careful and drink responsibly, okay? But there you have it. So let me just do the, uh, the usual test, hang on a minute. Oh, oh yeah. Oh gosh. Yeah, that's the one. So um, to find the recipe, www.pitchrestaurant.co.uk. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Tell me what you want me to cook. Tell me what recipes you want out there. Uh, and again, to everyone, to everyone who's out there, staying at home, staying safe, and trying to look after yourself. We're all together in this. So I hope you're all well. I hope your families are well. And thank you again for subscribing to the YouTube channel, Kenny Tut. Um, and I'll see you here again soon for some more drinks, fun, and food. Cheers. Yeah.